Okay, so I have a towel to tell, okay? Yes, yes. So we're sitting in our swim at the moment and our rods are out. And um, it is Bank Holiday Monday. Well, this is the story. It starts off when I went over to the um, hut earlier to put some beers in the freezer. Oh no, to get some beers. I'd already put some beers in the freezer and I wanted to go and get them. So I went over to get some uh, some beers and uh, Tony was in the swim and I left Charlie in charge of the rods. So Charlie, of course, for all of the, uh, my family that know me, whenever the football's on and I go to get a beer, there's a goal scored. So, as you can imagine, while the rods was out, when I went to get some beers, you guessed it, I get back, Charlie's bent into a carp on my rods. Anyway. Um... It got weeded and he lost it, which was unfortunate, but it's a bloody hard lake and, you know, that's what happens. Anyway, a few hours later, or a couple of hours later, Andy, who's in that far side over there, um, has a fish. It weeds him up and he needs a boat. He hasn't got a boat. We've got a boat. And Darren, up there, he's got a boat. Now... <clears throat> I shouted to Darren, you're nearest, do you want to go over and help Andy? And he did. So Charlie went and sat at Darren's rods. And you can guess what happened. So Darren goes out and helps Andy get his fish in. And they're out there for five or ten minutes. In the meantime, um, and uh, Darren's middle rod goes. And Charlie plays and lands a carp of £26 on the nose. So it's a personal best for Charlie Jones and a congratulations and a well done and a fantastic team effort because Darren helped Andy Andy helped the fish because it was stuck in weed and it, you know, worse things could happen to it um, Darren helped Andy Charlie went round and helped Darren in turn Darren has helped Charlie break his personal best so absolutely fantastic everyone's a winner and as Mr Eaton would say winner winner, chicken dinner <laughs>